Graduation season kicks off today here in Duval County. Such an exciting time for seniors. Students at the Mount Hermon Exceptional Student Center will mark this milestone today in just a few hours at 11 o'clock with thousands of others following over the next few weeks. News for Jackson reporter Brittany Muller is live outside Lee High School. And Brittany, uh, the biggest change this year, of course, is face coverings will be optional during outdoor ceremonies. Jen Bruce, that's right. Masks will be optional. And here at Lee High School, the graduation ceremony will be on Tuesday outside at the football stadium, like most of the other local Duval County high schools. The school district says, again, those masks will be optional because of new CDC guidelines, as well as now that the CDC says vaccines are available for those 12 and older. Duval High School's graduation starts today for seniors at Mount Hermon Exceptional Student Center. Most ceremonies will be held outdoors with no temperature checks and no mask requirement, but there are some exceptions. Andrew Jackson, A. Philip Randolph, Douglas Anderson, Darnell Cookman, and Frank H. Peterson are holding their ceremonies at the Times Union Theater downtown. None of those schools have a large enough venue to host an outdoor graduation. It's a step towards normalcy with new CDC guidelines. According to the Department of Health, since kids 12 and up can now get their shot, more than 264,000 people between the ages of 12 and 24 have received at least one shot across the state. Over the weekend, Duval schools worked with health officials to promote vaccine access. It held a vaccine clinic at Sandalwood High School. Last year's graduation ceremonies were postponed until July because of the pandemic. Many were held outdoors and with limitations on how many people could attend. Dr. Diana Green called it one of the most difficult decisions she's ever had to make. News for Jacks partnered with the district and high schools 9 through 12 to provide a televised tribute to the 2020 graduating class, highlighting how challenging and rewarding the year had been. We have the full list of the graduation ceremony schedule for all Duval County High Schools right now on newsforjacks.com. Also, Duval County School District is looking for family input regarding COVID-19 safety measures for the upcoming school year. You can also find that survey link right now on our website. Reporting live this morning from Lehigh, Brittany Muller, Channel 4, The Local Station.